Hello everyone, now, this is Dolphin Data Lab support team and this video is on how to change the heat map in ROM for the Rosewood hard drives. Now we can try to power on this pension hard drive and see the FINU. So obviously this is one uh, head damaged FINU. We can try to enter the DFL Seagate hard drive repair program. For this hard drive, the service arrow, the firmware arrow is not accessible, so we can only enter the program by boot mode. Boot mode means to operate within the ROM. Now we can see the serial number has been read and also the family name and this is my Rosewood 8C. Now we can enter the hard drive. So there is one very common function will be used for the Rosewood hard drives, that is within the ROM operations menu. So for this menu, we can find out all the functions are concerned with the ROM on the PCB. Now we have a backup the ROM already, so we can use this function and open file. Here, this is the ROM. We can check the serial number, the S3V, S3V. Now we can try to open this ROM and we can find out the head map is 0, 0 and 0, 1. Now this is top head and this is bottom head. Now suppose the top head is damaged, so we can try to change to 0, 0 and then click OK. After that we can go to the SAP and then select a Start and then select the end here start after that we click select zone check and then write to hard drive now we are writing the new room with the new head map to this Rosewood hard drives. This function is very helpful, especially when the drive has some weak head and the drive cannot be started normally. But please note that if the drive, the pension drive, has some very loud clinking noises or unusual noises. It's suggested to open the drive first and see if the drive heads has some physical structure change. If the heads are already damaged very badly, so at this time we must change the heads instead of turning off the heads in wrong. Now we can try to power off and then power on the drive again that means the new ROM has been valid now so at this time we need to read the new ROM and confirm if the head map the new head map is valid or not. Now we can check by read the new ROM. Enter the program again. Read from HDD.
now we can check head map now we can see that the phase head map is 0, 0, 0, 0. so this is new head map so when some times we have cases with physical head damage or weak heads we can try to use this way to change head map in ROM